Hi there, guys. For some people, a family is something sacred and truly special. Something you're supposed to cherish and protect. There are some essential things, some rules you've got to follow when you're married. Kevin Howard is one of those people who feels like family is a very important thing. He used to be married to a woman named Joyce for 12 years. Obviously, throughout that time they had some harsh moments and quarreling and things like that, but apart from that, Kevin and Joyce were pretty happy living together. All their friends and relatives thought they were really lucky to have each other. But one day their marriage was over. One early morning when Kevin was cooking breakfast, Joyce came up to him and said that it's time for them to get divorced. The man was shocked. He couldn't understand the reason behind such swift decision. He even asked his wife to give him a chance to make it all right in case he did something wrong, but Joyce didn't want to hear any of that. Nothing seemed to make things work out for the two of them. It seemed strange to Kevin, so he thought he should hire a detective to see what was really going on. Already a few days later, it turned out that his wife was cheating on him with his colleague. The guy he knew, the guy who was at his house, talking to his children and all that. They even went fishing together, and Kevin thought he was his friend. So that was a double blow on the part of his wife. Kevin didn't go and rough him up, he didn't hurt the guy physically. Instead, he did something that would probably surprise many people. He sued the man for the moral damage along with other things like psychiatrist expenses. The total amount was pretty big, $7,500,000. Kevin was smart enough to use the alienation of affections law that has to do with one of the spouses damaging the marriage. The thing about this law is that it was cancelled in most states in the US, but in North Carolina it still exists and Kevin found the right way to use it. Soon enough, the court ruled in favor of Kevin Howard, who received quite a substantial amount of money from the guy that was hanging out with his wife. Howard's lawyer said it was the first case of that caliber he had to deal with, and that he was glad that it turned out alright. Although year 2019 was the last year for this particular law, as for Kevin, he received his $750,000 and got divorced. He's now probably recovering after the dreadful event in his life. Alright guys, so if you think that Kevin did the right thing, press the like button. If you think he was wrong, press thumbs down. That's all for now, hope you enjoyed watching this video, thank you for watching, and we'll see you next time.